Socrates, the questioning man. Socrates, a name that echoes through history, was an ancient Greek philosopher who lived in Athens around 470 BC. Unlike other philosophers, he didn't write books or claim to have all the answers. Instead, Socrates was famous for his questions. The Gadfly of Athens Imagine a gadfly, a persistent insect that keeps buzzing around an animal. That's how some Athenians saw Socrates. He would walk around the marketplace, engaging people in conversation. He'd ask questions about important things like courage, justice, and what it means to be a good person. The Socratic Method Socrates didn't lecture. He used a method now called the Socratic Method. Here's how it worked. Start with a question. Socrates would ask someone a question about a big idea, like, what is courage? Challenge the answer. The person would give an answer, but Socrates wouldn't accept it easily. He'd ask follow-up questions that challenged their thinking. Seek clarity. Through this back and forth, the person would often realize their answer wasn't perfect. They might refine their definition or admit they didn't know as much as they thought. Why ask questions? Why did Socrates spend his days asking questions? He believed that true knowledge comes from self-examination. By questioning their own beliefs, people could reach a deeper understanding of themselves and the world. Making people uncomfortable Socrates' method often made people uncomfortable. He exposed their flaws in logic and showed that even respected leaders might not have all the answers. This upset some powerful Athenians who felt threatened by his questioning. Trial and Death Socrates was accused of impiety and corrupting the youth. He was put on trial and sentenced to death. Even though he could have escaped, Socrates chose to obey the law and accept his punishment. He drank hemlock, a poisonous drink, and died in 399 BC. Socrates' Legacy Though Socrates died, his ideas lived on. His students, like Plato and Xenophon, wrote about his teachings, making him one of the most influential philosophers in history. The Socratic method is still used today in education and many other fields. Why is Socrates still important? Socrates teaches us the importance of asking questions, don't just accept things at face value. Think critically and ask questions to understand the world around you. Examining our beliefs, we all have assumptions. Socrates reminds us to challenge our own ideas and be open to new information. Thinking for ourselves, don't rely on others to tell you what to think. Engage in thoughtful discussions and form your own opinions. The gadfly may be gone but his questions continue to challenge us to this day. By embracing the spirit of Socrates, we can all strive for a deeper understanding of ourselves and the world around us. Socrates' Famous Quotes The unexamined life is not worth living. I am the wisest man alive, for I know one thing, and that is that I know nothing. There is only one good, knowledge, and one evil, ignorance. Wonder is the beginning of wisdom. Strong minds discuss ideas, average minds discuss events, weak minds discuss people. Be kind, for everyone you meet is fighting a hard battle. The only true wealth is that which you can carry with you. Education is the kindling of a flame, not the filling of a vessel. Prefer knowledge to wealth, for the one is transitory, the other perpetual. By all means marry, if you get a good wife, you'll become happy, if you get a bad one, you'll become a philosopher. 
This quote is meant to be humorous and doesn't necessarily reflect Socrates' true views on marriage. Be slow to fall into friendship, but when thou art in, continue firm and constant. He is not a true friend who shares your joys, the true friend shares your grief. An unexamined life is not worth living. To find yourself, think for yourself. The only good is knowledge and the only evil is ignorance. Do not do to others what angers you if done to you by others. Every action has its pleasures and its price. I am not an Athenian or a Greek, but a citizen of the world. False words are not only evil in themselves, but they infect the soul with evil. Think not those faithful who praise all thy words and actions, but those who kindly reprove thy faults. Main Keywords Socrates an influential thinker from ancient Athens who believed in the power of questioning to gain knowledge. Athens, a center of learning and democracy in ancient Greece, where Socrates lived and taught. Socratic method, a way of asking questions to challenge someone's thinking and help them reach a deeper understanding. Philosophy, the pursuit of knowledge and understanding about the world and ourselves. Courage, the strength to face fear or difficulty and do what is right. Justice, treating everyone according to what they deserve. Good person, someone who acts with honesty, kindness, and fairness. Questioning, analyzing information carefully and considering different perspectives before forming an opinion. Self-examination, thinking about your own beliefs, actions, and motivations. Legacy, the long-term influence someone or something has. Asking questions, seeking information and understanding by asking thoughtful questions. Examining beliefs, questioning the ideas you hold true to see if they are still valid. Thinking for oneself, forming your own opinions based on evidence and reasoning, not just what others tell you.